Hello students. Now we'll solve the third question of exercise 2.1. And in this question, we have to check whether this given figure is a magic square or not. A magic square is a square in which sum of each row, each column, and each diagonal is same. So as I mentioned, this is the first row, second row, third row. This is the first column, second column, third column, left diagonal and right diagonal. So first of all we write the rows, then we write the columns, and then we write the diagonals. So first of all the first row. In the first row it is 4 upon 11 plus 9 upon 11 plus 2 upon 11. So the denominator is the same. So LCM will be 11 only. Now we will add the numerator. 4 plus 9 is 13 and 13 plus 2 is 15. So the first row will be 15 upon 11. Now we will check the second row. That is 3 upon 11 plus 5 upon 11 plus 7 upon 11. Again, the LCM will be 11. Now we'll add the 7 plus 3 is 10 and 10 plus 5 is 15. So again, it will be 15 upon 11. Now we'll check for the third row. 8 upon 11 plus 1 upon 11 plus 6 upon 11. Again, the LCM will be 11. 8 plus 1 is 9 and 9 plus 6 is 15. So 15 upon 11. Now we'll check the first diagonal. Means left diagonal. So this is the left diagonal. And now for this, we'll add 8 upon 11 plus 5 upon 11 plus 2 upon 11. So 8 plus 2 is 10 and 10 plus 5 is 15. So again it will be 15 upon 11. Now we'll check for the columns. So the first column is 4 upon 11 plus 3 upon 11 plus 8 upon 11. So again the LCM will be 11. 4 plus 3 is 7 and 7 plus 8 is 15. So 15 upon 11. Then for column 2, 9 upon 11 plus 5 upon 11 plus 1 upon 11. That is 9 plus 1 is 10 and 10 plus 5 is 15. So again it will be 15 upon 11. Now we will check the third column. 2 upon 11 plus 7 upon 11 plus 6 upon 11. That will be 7 plus 2 is 9 and 9 plus 6 is 15 upon 11. Now we will check for the right diagonal. Means we will check for this diagonal. And that is 4 upon 11 plus 5 upon 11 plus 6 upon 11. So 6 plus 4 is 10 and 10 plus 5 is 15. So again it will be 15 upon 11. Now you can see that all the rows, all the columns and all the diagonals are having the same sum. So we can say that this square is a magic square. And this is how you can solve this question. Thank you.